Our great war is a spiritual war. Our great depression is our lives. Recently I watched um, Fight Club and I realized that, you know, this is kind of a, it's still going on now, even though it was wrote in 96 and the movie was done in 99. It's still kind of going on now and how men are kind of lost in this kind of consumerist age and this job kind of vacuum like um you know always the next thing next thing maybe this will be the thing maybe this will kind of be better and then it's like this constant cycle of needing something external to kind of feel good internally i'm just reading notes on my hand you know you get a uni get a job then get married and a quote that I like from it is like, get married. I'm not sure if another woman is going to solve our problems because we're a generation raised by women. And you think before that in the 40s and the um, World War II and World War I and how that created such strong, you know, men. And then now we don't really have the Great War. You know, our Great War is kind of the, the spiritual war. It's like our own minds. Um, society trying to kind of keep us numb and you know it's kind of sad and then another one that they say is like get married I'm a 30 year old boy and like that's that's like weird to think about because but it's so true you know you know just doing kind of what you're told you're not facing anything difficult you're not doing anything hard and then this is where like the alter ego, you know, Tyler Durden comes in and it's like extreme to this other side, you know, and they embrace pain and they go out and seek it and they try to get as much as they can to try and get that masculine drive back into them. And then they create this cult and, you know, and then it's kind of like they're facing their death, you know, they're trying to kill that part of themselves. And then it comes to this extreme point where you know, his insomnia is kind of making him go crazy and turning him into Tyler Durden to do all these kind of things. And at one point he kind of says, I am Jack's wasted life. And you know, Jack is like, it's like a basic boy name. And it could mean any of us, you know, wasted their lives either in corporate things, chasing things that they don't actually want, they don't actually need, or in the other extreme, you know, becoming a like a punk kind of like pioneer and you're just like going out and destroying everything and fighting against it rather than like trying to find a solution and finding this middle way you know it's kind of like this emotional reaction where you just feel so deeply hurt and dissatisfied with society and life that you go out and just have to wreck things and the last kind of point I wanted to make was um, kind of throughout there's like these hints towards a bad kind of childhood and a bad fathering with him and it's like with Marla and Tyler he said it was like my parents um, were back with me and how we kind of can create this cycle of comfort that we have when we're childs if and if we're not wary of it and we're not willing to face it then we're going to be kept in like the same cycle and it's going to continue on like it kind of has now you know we're still facing a lot of these fight pro flight club problems now and that's kind of like dealing with like parts of your trauma and like abandonment and like facing your fears and that sort of thing. And that's why I decided I'd write this video or talk outside because I was all kept up in my room and I was so scared of coming out because I live in a small town and if I go out there's going to be people around that I know. But then small town, you know, there's not going to be as many people so I'm not going to feel as judged. But when I see those people, I'm going to know them. so. I'm going to feel quite judged and I thought I'd just do a loop kind of around here while I was talking and discussing this idea because it's important to kind of find what we're scared of because sometimes we can easily bullshit ourselves you know and say oh yeah I'm creating YouTube videos I'm doing something good you know but I was kind of in my comfort zone just writing doing the videos at home kind of in my own kind of state and then Fight Club really stirred me up and I felt really kind of triggered I'm like oh crap I'm kind of spiraling into another um 
nihilistic kind of episode I'm like what's the point of everything and then I felt myself getting really emotional like oh my god I have to go out and go to the extreme and then cut everything out and then my workout should be hard and I was kind of like in this train of thought and I realized no this is just an emotional reaction this is just something that I feel like I need to do extreme because high emotion you feel like you have to do something extreme to yourself and I'm like no it's kind of more simple than that like just kind of do what you're scared of do what you know you should be doing and it's kind of simple like I didn't want to come out here and walk around outside in public and do this video I was like oh my god maybe I should just watch a YouTube video first maybe I could just record it inside but I just put the mic on stood at the door got out and started recording and I did it and is it as hard as I thought it would be no it's like the initial part is but then afterwards it's a lot easier and this is something that you could use for anything you know like talking to girls and you know it doesn't have to be extreme you know you don't have to go out in public and start talking to everyone and like going to like a big city like for me I was just like I can do a walk around the park there'll be a few people there but there won't be so many that I'll feel too awkward but it's a step in the right direction and I guess that's all we can kind of do so thanks for listening if you did I hope the video was okay and I wasn't too shaky my arms like killing me because I'm like holding this up here even though it's like just my phone it's like I don't know, probably have to work on that. But anyway, I hope that the idea got across and I'll see you in the next video.